I have two follow-up questions for you. If a player pitches and plays the field in college, do you have to pick either pitcher or fielder, or can you do both? Uh, you can do both as long as you're determined to do so. And I don't know if the coaches would agree with me, but every school I've been to, it's the player, not the coach, that ends up you know, basically eliminating one of those things. Uh, Ryan Lawless was recruited to be a 90 mile an hour lefty at Missouri, which he was. Thought he was a pretty good hitter. And uh, he started walking more guys in his life than he'd ever walked. That's because he was pitching to college hitters that had better eyes and better discipline. Uh, so he said, I just want to hit. And wasn't going to argue with him. And he played for the San Francisco Giants for a little bit. So he could hit just fine. But most guys end up eliminating one of those two on their own. Evan Lee at Arkansas is the most determined kid. Boy Scout off the field and definitely assassin crazy man on the field. And uh, he refused to give up either of those two at Arkansas, and he was good enough to do both. And um, I, I think as long as you're good enough to do something, you do it until someone tells you you can't. So I, I wish I would have had the opportunity to play minor league baseball, but you know, some of those guys to a fault are just playing until someone says, it's time for you to go home, man. Uh, but that's, that's how I would approach the two-way thing and other sports. We're recruiting a kid right now for basketball and baseball, which would be incredibly difficult to pull off, and he wants to do it.